Good morning. It's Monday at about 7.30 a.m. I've made my coffee and my cereal, as you saw, and currently it is snowing pretty heavily outside. Um, so I'm probably just gonna stay home and get some work done. Here's my little work situation. I use that pregnancy pillow to make my couch more comfortable. Um, but I've got my breakfast and my laptop and I think Jared said he's gonna work from home this morning too, so. Good morning, Dwight. take you guys out here and show you how beautiful the snow is. This is the snow that's on our balcony. I just love it when it snows. I don't know how some people don't like it, but I have never stopped getting excited by it. Maternity leggings, it's actually just my regular leggings, and then just with this t shirt, it's really comfortable. I feel like this outfit shows up my bum more than anything that I have. I don't know if you can kind of see it, but it's a little bump. Um, but I'm just gonna get ready. Usually in the mornings, I don't have like a really set schedule. Um, sometimes I have meetings in the mornings, but um, most of the time, I can kind of just like get up when I feel like it and get work done as I feel like it. So that's what I'm doing this morning. I'm just gonna get ready and drink my coffee and we'll go from there. things planned. I'm planning on today shooting um, some of my minimalism series with my wardrobe. So I'm going to be shooting some pictures and taking some videos and I'll kind of like talk you through what the blog is going to be about and the content that I'm going to share on Instagram. Um, anyway, I'll just go ahead and talk you through some of my wardrobe stuff right now. So this drawer, um, I got these little um, dividers which I find very handy but so on this side is obviously bras sports bras bralettes um, all my socks are in here and then underwear and I have like tank tops and stuff in the back here um, I need to buy more underwear I run out at the end of every week um, so that's where everything else is there's kind of like some overflow in the back there um, but that's my top drawer. The second drawer is usually a little bit neater. So like my chunky knits, I would love to hang up, but um, I've been told not to because they'll stretch out. So I'm gonna just pull these out so you can kind of see um, what the rest is. So I have these three long sleeve shirts um, that and sweatshirts type things. And then I have jeans. Oh wait, one more long sleeve shirt. That's kind of more of like an active wear one. I usually wear that hiking a lot. So then I have, um, I have these jeans. Usually, I actually only have one pair of normal jeans right now. Um, a friend brought me some hand-me-down maternity jeans and then all of a sudden I had like six pairs of maternity jeans and um, so I have, a, I have a, I'm kind of set with jeans right now. Um, so there's those three, and then these are like just leggings, and some of them are active wear, so they could go over here if I wanted. Um, but I kind of like to just keep them all together. And then over here are all my shirts. So there's some long sleeve, some short sleeve, just kind of a mixture. And then I also have some hung up in my closet that I'll show you later on. Um, but that is that drawer. 
and the bottom drawer is kind of a mess. It's mainly just like my outdoor gear, so like my backpack and then I have like a jacket that's all folded up down here. This is the jacket that I take hiking a lot um, and then I have some like cycling clothes. Um, yeah, that's not a drawer that I get into that often, but it kind of works to just have it right there. Have my yak tracks right there. Um, so that's that drawer. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna start getting out my, start shooting some pictures and getting started with the minimalism content. So these are the clothes that I have hanging up. I do have a few like out of season clothes still hanging in the closet. So this is my closet. Um, Jared's side is over here. That's like all his clothes. And then I just have a few things still hanging up in the back, but those are just out of season. So I'm just gonna show you what I have here. So I have three basic jackets that I wear in the winter. Um, I have this, which you've probably seen in every single one of my photos and videos. Um, I love this Pico. It is like a mix of wool and cashmere. I can try to link one for you. Um, I got mine on eBay and it just fits me perfectly and will never regret that. <laughs> um, that's just kind of a rain jacket. It's like an army green color. Really, I just wear that on warmer days or if it's raining, which is kind of rare in the winter. And then I just have this cardigan. It's mainly like for indoors, and I can layer that underneath the pico if I want to. And then I have this long sleeve shirt. It's just nice and comfy. I think it's gonna fit me up until I have a baby. And then I have this little number. Um, I just like it. It's kind of dressier than my other clothes and um, it's kind of cute with the bump. I have this denim piece that is a staple for me. Um, it gets wrinkled really easily though, so I need to iron it. And then I have um, this little piece. Uh, is another good one. I think I buy really loose clothes. Um, just naturally so I haven't really needed to buy any maternity clothes we'll see if there ends up being things I need and then I have this gym um, this says coffee and flowers which are my two favorite things but I just love that little sweater so I keep that hung up so this is honestly pretty much everything that I have for the winter I do have a suitcase underneath my bed that I put out of season clothes. So unless it fits in here um, or in my drawers, I pretty much get rid of it. And I, I guess one exception is that I do have some snow clothes and I keep those separately. They're just too bulky to keep in my closet or my drawers. And I just don't use them very often, but it's definitely necessary in the colder climates. But honestly, like that pea coat, keeps me warm down to like 15 degrees. And I have little gloves that I wear with it too. But yeah, this is everything. Um, you'll probably notice like there's pretty much just neutral colors. Um, and I like that because everything goes together in my wardrobe. And I don't really have to spend a lot of time figuring out what to wear. And I get to just wear my favorite clothes every day, so. So we are going to head out for a little bit to go work at a coffee shop. Um, Jared is going to be working from home all day today, so that'll be fun, but it's nice to have like a change of scenery every now and then. But quickly, I wanted to show you, there's somebody outside that did not roll their window up, and I really want to see when they find out that, <laughs> that their window was rolled down during the, the snow.
This is why I married. back home now um, it has since stopped snowing the sky, the sky is all blue and you can see the mountains again um, I am just here getting some work done and I've just eaten this entire thing of popcorn um, I got this air popper for popcorn which has been one of my number one cravings and um, it just came in the mail today so I, there, there is like that, that Tupperware was completely full and I pretty much just inhaled it. It was so good. So I'm going to chill here and get some work done for a while and um, I'll check back in with you later. So it's about five o'clock. I'm going to start some dinner. Um, I am done working for the day and I have some pumpkin and some coconut milk in the fridge. So I think I'm going to use that with some sweet potatoes and other ingredients to make like a sweet potato, pumpkin, sweet curry type thing. So I'm going to be working on that um, and I will show you when it's done. It's only 8.15 right now, but I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. I'm already super tired, but um, this was the first vlog I've ever done, and I think I did a pretty good job of remembering to turn the camera on and like talk you through my day. Um, but I'm planning to continue these, and hopefully you guys enjoy that. Bye.